Yo, what up 2K fans, it's your boy Venice. Now in today's video, I'm going to be breaking down the way to dribble on this build. And as a matter of fact, on any build on 2K. Now a lot of you guys have been asking me to show you how I dribble on this build. How do I get open? What dribble moves do I use? And I'm here to um, debunk the myth that you gotta use, you know. YouTubers dribble moves or your favorite 2k players dribble move to have success and uh, To actually be able to dribble there are no combos to do in this game that uh, You know require a, a high amount of stick skills practice uh, Labbing in my court for hours try, trying to pull off certain dribble moves there there are no such things on 2k uh, for, uh, as far as just six go, so uh, dribble moves, signature style, just go in there, pick what you like, and uh, it'll, you'll 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 make it work, bro. If you if you've ever ever played ball in real life, do you uh, do you stand there trying to copy Kyrie Irving's dribble moves or Steph's dribble moves? No, bro. You you just use what you like and you perfect it, and you try to make it work. Uh, the, it, at the best of your capability and 2k is the same thing bro you don't need these momentum spin back uh, snatch uh, double cross uh, you don't need all of this you just need some effective dribble moves and uh, in this video i'm gonna going to show you how to pull them off and uh, trying to prove to you guys that you don't need fancy dribbles and combos to be able to have success now uh this video isn't going to be full-on gameplay I picked some uh, some valuable clips that I got on the one-on-one -on -one court and I'm going to be breaking them down to you guys and just once again showing you that you don't need to be hella fancy with these dribble moves, you don't need to overthink it. Alright, so let's get into breaking down some of these moves. Alright, so first move we're gonna start by the most simple, let's watch it full speed and then we're going to break it down. Now, as you can see, this was very, very simple as a dribble sequence. I, uh, you got to analyze what your defender is trying to do. Now, on this side hop, I'm noticing that this guy is going to cover baseline to prevent the dunk. So, we're going to watch it in slow-mo. As you can see, he's in my face, so I hop it to my right side. And as you can see, this dude is deciding to cover the baseline angle. So uh, he gives me the top of the key wide open, so I'm just gonna snatch it behind my back to get that little speed boost from quick first step. Run all the way to the top of the key, top of the mid range, and this green, he's got the late contest because he didn't cover his angles properly. Now this next move is going to put value into the signature combos that 2K gives to us. Now as you can see, I start up this sequence by resetting my position by hopping backward. Then I start up the dribble combo, the signature combo that gets uh, going with the uh, joystick, right joystick going up, signature, signature combo going. There are so much windows of crossover in this uh, little sequence only. We're gonna count them, so there's one, there's two, there's three, and then four. And then I'm going to pick the fifth one by crossing this guy over to his left, and the rest is history. So this next move is gonna show you that you can use your opponent's momentum against him. As you can see, I run to one side, snatch it back and just cross him over by going to the same side I was originally planning to go. Now watching this move in slow-mo really lets you understand that this dude just had to stop on a dime to prevent me from uh, going to his left. So I use that against him and just get going right back where I was planning to go and there's just nothing he could do to prevent it. Now before we get into one of the most complex sequence here's another another example of the nice signature combo which I get out of on the fifth crossover window and that gets him pretty well once again as you can see 
cross him over. I like waiting until the end of it because it's less predictable. Alright, so let's take all you guys just learned and put it all together in one position. That actually that wasn't on purpose, but I got this clip in the same game. So we're gonna take a look, look at all these moves uh, paired together. What kind of dribble sequence you can expect on a possession that uh, your defender plays pretty well. So I start off this sequence by resetting my position, hopping backwards. Then I'm going to start up a signature combo and get out of it at the first window. So that is a pretty good quick double cross that you can do out of the signature combo. I'm gonna snatch it back because he's following me like a boss and uh, I'm pretty stuck right there. So I'm going to hop it left. He follows it perfectly. So let's hop to the right. Once again, signature combo, get out of it first. Uh, crossover window which is what I do right there I'm gonna stop on a dime which he does as well and go back the same way I was originally going which gets me open for this pull up mid range so let's watch it again full speed to really get a grasp of what's happening in there doesn't seem like much but when you actually think about it there are pretty much uh, five to six different moves combined in one possession but they are still simple and that's what most important you don't need the half spins double cross momentum behind the back snatches to be effective on any build in this game you just need to know a little bit what you're doing you know what your animations look like pick the right sigs for your playstyle. do not copy other people's signature styles it is absolutely useless so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you want me to break down some more clips like i just did maybe for uh triple threats or maybe shots or post moves i could do it uh, i like i like breaking down clips for you so uh, if you want to see more of these make sure to comment down below and let me know like the video if you enjoyed subscribe if it's not done already and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace